A whale stranded in Gulf Shores. You may have seen the photos on social media. Well, tonight we have learned it's part of a troubling trend along the Gulf Coast. The third incident in just the past month. NBC 15's Corey Pippen has that story all new tonight at 10. The discovery of a sick, dying pygmy whale here in the shallow waters off Gulf Shores is amazing and saddening locals while raising questions about why the deep sea mammal was here in the first place. This video of a pygmy sperm whale struggling to survive in the shallow surf off the beaches of Gulf Shores is heartbreaking to see for any animal lover. Even harder for one who was filming it. It was horrible. It was very sad. We were hopeful through this whole ordeal that they would be able to save him. Kim Rumpel spotted the animal around noon on Sunday from her home on West Beach Boulevard. His belly was really red and scratched up and he had sores around his mouth. He was just laying there and getting beat in the surf. Rumpel got in touch with the Dolphin Island Sea Lab and tried to help the whale breathe while the lab's crews responded. Dr. Alyssa Deming, veterinarian with the lab's Alabama Marine Mammal Stranding Network, says the whale was young, suffered from pneumonia, shock, and shark bites, and had to be euthanized. Pygmy sperm whales that have stranded um, typically don't make it through the rehabilitation process. So the fact that this animal was so sick, we decided that it would be best um, for this animal to ease its suffering. It's the third offshore marine mammal stranding along the Gulf Coast since Hurricane Michael last month. Dr. Deming says the silver lining is tests on this whale can help determine whether the animals are victims of something storm related or even scarier, red tide which has devastated marine life along much of South Florida's coasts. So we can get a really good in-depth picture of what was going on with the health of that animal, and that will also allow us to test for the presence of red tide. Officials say if you notice any struggling or dead marine mammals here along our coasts, the best thing you can do is contact 1-877-WHALE-HELP. In Gulf Shores, I'm Corey Pippen, NBC 15.